the next step for us is a product we're bringing online soon that is a, an auto grid cassette puck. So the, the pipeline for um, sample collection is that uh, typically you put them in cryo grid boxes, screen them, then if you had good samples, you would then take a, a similar sample, clip it, place it into uh, a auto grid cassette box or an auto grid, sorry, an auto grid puck or they, uh, or an auto grid cassette, excuse me. Um, and so then this allows you to ship and transport your auto grid cassettes like you would uh, a standard puck with cryo grid boxes. So um, here's an image of it being inserted into a standard cryo cane that would use the cryo M pucks, but you could also send it in the transport cane. So an accessory to the standard puck storage. And so this design here goes inside of the standard cassette uh, loading capsule or vessel. And you can then transfer clipped grids from uh, grid boxes into the cassette. The cassette then um, can be sealed in place using this protective lid and then transferred using the same set of tongs that you use to move the other pucks around. And uh, the vision being that this will allow users to one, prepare their clipped grids at their facility and then uh, if they have a uh, Glaciers screen their grids with an auto loader and then send the same grids off for data collection at a high power microscope or to just clip and prepare their grids and send them off for data collection. So this is a uh, auto grid cassette uh, loading station and so typically it would come with a a particular insert uh, in it that holds the cassette in the grid boxes like I showed you in the auto grid inspection image. But here um, you can using the using the standard tools you can transfer in an auto grid cassette. You could then transfer gr clips grids from your cryo grid boxes into the cassette. Uh, this lid then rotates just like the puck. It locks in place just like the puck and can then uh, be transferred from here into uh, a shipping or a storage doer, or you can then receive a auto grid cassette puck and then um, using the standard mechanics, open it back up securely, take uh, the transfer tool and then transfer it into say the, the capsule for loading the auto mounter or auto loader. Um, so in addition to that, um, I talked about the uh, auto grid inspection station. And so I will try to get this the focal point where you can actually see it. But um, this is designed to be inserted into any one of these wells and allows users to easily flip back and forth their, um, their grid. And so uh, you can inspect for clipping and make sure that everything looks good prior to transferring that into the cassette. And so this would go in any location where you could stick a standard crowd grid box whether it is in uh, this puck or whether it is in the, the standard loading station for the uh, grid.